Hello Cancer and welcome to my channel Mind's Eye Inspiration. This is going to be a reading for you for the month of March 2022. I'd like to say thank you for all the likes, shares and subscribes that I've received so far. And if you haven't already subscribed to my channel, then please do so because that helps me reach my goal of my first 1000 subscribers and it lets me know that you appreciate the content that I'm putting out. I'll put a link in the description box below to a book here that I've got available on Amazon. It's a book that I co-wrote with my sister um, and it's an introduction to mediumship and my sister also has her own YouTube channel Anything Spiritual so I will put a link in the description box below to Anything Spiritual so you can listen to your reading with my sister as well. Okay Cancer, this is the past and we can see that you've been struggling for the past few weeks or months with money. Look at this, you've got the six of coins. Money coming in, money coming out. It seems to me, Cancer, that as fast as you pay one bill, another bill comes in. It's like Robin Peter to pay Paul and you're just trying to keep ahead. And then this is you at the moment, at the four of coins so it's saying at the moment you are stable you are safe you've got stability and you have got financial security so you're in a better situation now than what you was let's pull another card over that the lover's card so for those of you that are in relationships, this is saying that you and your relation, you, you and your partner have managed to put your resources together and you're helping each other paying the bills, you know, working hard and keeping the um keeping the roof over your head. Um, the lovers also can signify a move, so it could be that some of you moved to a smaller property that financially is made it easier to run or easier to maintain. And this is your future card look. Again, the eight of coins. So you've got a lot of coins card. It seems to be all about money for you, Cancer. All about the money. And this shows you working really, really hard. So you're going to continue to work hard to provide for you and your family to pay the bills and I do believe that you are getting there cancer you know you're in a better situation than what you was you're gonna keep going you're gonna improve your finances I mean look at this this is showing you know all this money here so to me this is saying there is money there for you you know you will have savings in the bank you will reach that point where you've got all this money behind you look and still more to come. He's still making more. Look, he's made loads and he's got more to come. So you will be in a situation, Cancer, where you financially have a good amount of money behind you as security, as a backup that you can put in the bank, put in savings. You know, so you will get there. You've got the Ten of Swords. Now, this is in in the place on the layout of what is help or what is hindering you. So I think this is what's hindering you, Cancer, the Ten of Swords. So swords represent the mind. So I feel that mentally you've been through a bit of a struggle. Mentally, it feels like you've had this mental battle on your hand. So it could be that you suffer with low mood or depression and you're finding it really really hard at the minute it's like really hard to get up and go to work to find that motivation to find that strength to just get up and go you know and the feeling that I'm getting as I talk about this is really tired and really weighed down and this is I believe how some of you are feeling at the moment it's just like everything feels like a struggle to get up in the mornings to go to work you know come home then you've got the housework to do the shopping to do and everything 
feels like a bind it feels like a struggle and you're finding it really really hard to keep that motivation going and to keep your strength up and this could be to do with something from the past that you lost so this could be that some of you are still suffering from a bereavement with the three of swords there some of you are probably suffering from um past hurt past fallout from a relationship and you've still got those scars you're still coming out of that loss that hurt that bereavement and you're just finding it hard to find that motivation but do keep going cancer do keep plodding on do keep putting your hard work into everything because this is your outcome look, the three of wands and it shows everything coming together. The threes are about things coming together. You can see this man, he's looking into the distance, his dreams, his desires, his wishes and they're almost in front of him look, he can almost touch them. He's got the fire here look, the enthusiasm, the energy so it will come cancer that energy that fire that you know it will come to you you just keep going and you will start to feel better you will start to feel more energized you will start to have those creative ideas just come to you and things that you're working hard towards will start to come together and things will get better for you so although things are a struggle at the moment, you know, if you just keep going cancer, take each day as it comes, you will get there in the end. We've got some Doreen Virtue Angel Therapy Oracle cards. I'm just going to give those a shuffle and we'll just see. Oh, <laughs> we've had four jump out here. Cancel, clear, delete. Use only positive words and thoughts as they're readily manifesting into form. So, you know, that's reminding you that every thought that you think is so powerful, you don't realise. And the words that you speak, you know, they have power behind them. So if you speak positive words and you do positive actions, then you can make your wishes and your dreams come true. And you've got cooked cords. Clear any old attachments or fear that stem from past relationships and hurt and cause destructive patterns. So get rid of anything that's negative and destructive in your life, Cancer. Clear away, even if it's just memories. You need to clear that negativity and that hurt from your thoughts so that you can only think positive thoughts throat chakra the angels are helping you lovingly to speak your truth so is there something that you want to say cancer something that's on your mind and you've been really wanting to say it to somebody but you daredn't Ask the universe to help you and find the strength to speak your truth you can speak the truth with kind words even if people don't like what you've got to say if you feel you want to say it then you've got the right to say it you've got just as much right as anybody else to voice your opinions voice your fears voice your desires you know so look you can say it kindly you can put it in a nice way think of the nicest way that you can say it and you know and just release that fear and have that conversation that you've been dreading. Vacuum away fear. Call upon Archangel Michael and Raphael to lift your fear-based energy, your surroundings, this situation and everyone involved. So again, it's releasing that fear. What are you scared of, Cancer? Who is it that's trying to control you or not letting you Say what you want to say. Release those fears. Have the strength to do what you want to do. Say what you want to say and have that dreaded conversation. Because the more it's on your mind, the more it's eating away at you. So there we go, Cancer. 
that's your message for March 2022 and I really hope that it's helped you in some way if it has then do click that like and subscribe button and, and you can always leave me a comment as well in the comments box below to let me know if that reading has resonated with you don't forget to check out the description box to my sister's YouTube channel anything spiritual and the book that we have available on Amazon the spirit within which is an introduction to mediumship and it's a lovely book to treat yourself to or to buy somebody else for a gift well thank you for watching cancer don't forget as well as my monthly readings i also do release weekly readings so don't forget to come back at the weekend to listen to a weekly reading as well